Today, guys, we are back with some more Shining Fates products. As you guys know, I haven't been opening too much Shining Fates. That's because all of the stock that we had for the store has been going out to pre-orders and to you guys as priority. However, we have now received our delivery of the mini tins, and I can confirm we have plenty of these to go around. These are really awesome. I believe you get two packs per tin, as well as a coin, as well as some art inside of it. Now, these products are clearly catered towards the kids and the children more than they are us. So we are going to prioritize these products on Pokeran.net towards the verified Pokeran product parents list which I can confirm has now had over 400 entries and it's also hit the limit of 400 so we can't accept any more people now until we go and clear that list and remove some of the files Google Drive has reached capacity but the way it's gonna work is if you're accepted into the list and if you can prove you collect with your your children or your children collect Pokemon cards as long as you're signed in you'll see products specifically catered towards you so no one else can buy these products you're gonna get products as giveaways you're gonna get products at retail never going above retail and often in certain cases lower than retail there'll be discounts as well with that being said let's get into the first one we have a Celebi number 251 we've got the coin right there the Manaphy coin interestingly enough the Celebi card art right here which is a really cool Celebi artwork and the Rillaboom as well so it's the exact artwork you can see on the front of the tin which is really cool and then we have two Shining Fates booster packs now what I'm going to do is I'm going to open all the tins now and then we can just open the packs all together in one go another Manaphy coin and the Reshiram artwork 10 foot 6 wow is that a Shiny Cinderace 2 I think it is. I think it is. Can okay, have the Zarude with the Manaphy coin. And now, is there a shiny Pokemon in here too? I think that Elder Gloss is shiny as well. Am I right, guys? That Elder Gloss is shiny? I've just realized this set is Shining Fates. So yes, of course they're shiny. <laughs> of course they're shiny. Oh my gosh. All right, here we go. 20 packs of Shining Fates. Now, these packs are a little bit crimpled, of course, just because of the fact that they were in the small tins. But let's go. Let's get into these 20 packs of Shining Fates. I've barely opened this set other than my initial 100 pack opening video. So I'm really excited for this. Let's see what we can do. Coco's always white, remember? So no worries about any spoilers. Four from the back. Give it a tap. And we have the Water Energy. Roosted Shield. Rotom. Tropius. Rowlet. Buizel. Spinarok. Spinarak, sorry, more Pekko, a Grookey, a Reverse Holo Dartrix, and that is severely off center. When I say severely, I mean severely. And then we have the Hollow Thievul towards the end. And I wonder if it's going to be the same throughout this entire opening. So we have four from the back. I was going to say three, but that would be incorrect. We've got a Lightning Energy, Luxio, Dartrix, a Eldegoss, Yanma, Horsey, Shinx, Spinarak. We have a Grookey. A reverse holo snomp, and then we have a Greedon, the cute little guy. <laughs> Four from the back. You know what? I should actually show you the codes because you can't tell anyway. Eldegoss, Rusted Shield, Team Yell Towel, Cufant. We have a Spinarak, Tootle. I think I can see something in the back. Cacnea. Oh, I can. There we go. You see that? You see that? More Peko and a Golden Eternators VMAX. Yes. And the reason I'm happy, of course, because it's a gold card, but the reason I'm even more happy is because I need this. Because I bought like three Eternators Vs, not like the full art Vs, not the VMAXs. You probably saw that in my Hidden Fates versus Shining Fates video. We then have a Professor's Research. But here we go. What a beautiful card. I've been needing this. I love this card. I love Eternators in general. It's like you can't even. You can't, ooh, the corners are a little bit sharp up there. The center is not great, but still, like, you can't really tell what this Pokemon is, and that's why I love it. It's, like, so weird and, like, like what is this Pokemon? The mystery intrigues me, which means I end up liking this Pokemon more than I usually would, I think. Four from the back. Give it a tap. We have the Fire Energy. You know what? These are quite... Did they rush these to print? Probably. Gym Trainer, Tropius, Floatzel, Gossifleur, Eevee, Nickit, Morpeko, a Rowlet behind that, a gym trainer, and then a Thievul again. Those of you out there who've been opening a lot of Shining Fates, are you sick of Thievul yet? Let me know in the comments. We have the code card for you beautiful people. We've got one, two, three, four. Check out the Pokeran.net store. Still got loads of stuff in stock, guys. We're restocking a lot recently. Binders, Japanese booster boxes, even English stuff. Like, keep a lookout. People always ask us, when are you going to restock? When are you going to restock? We do restock. You just probably miss it. Spinarak, we have, oh, we have something shiny. We've got a Tutel. We have a Predictions. I want to guess, now I don't, I don't know the number, but I want to guess from that shine that we're going to have a Lapras. Ooh, a Grimmsnarl V. Very nice. Now, am I right in saying that again? This is quite OC, <laughs> off-center. I believe it. Oh, look at that shine though. What, what a beautiful card this is, man. Look at that shine. Look at the rainbow effect. Ooh, look at this card. Next pack we have, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, what the hell? That was like sticking out, man. Put your predictions down below, guys. Pause the video and put your predictions. I saw that sticking out. I'm going to say that's a Toxtricity V shiny, okay? And if it is, I'm going to be so angry that it was sticking out, man. We saw it. It just fell right out of the pack. Qfin, I can't get these straight like I used to. Or is it my camera's tilted? Maybe my camera's tilted a bit. Rowlet. Oh my gosh, it's just... Gossip Fleur. Coffee. It just, it, just, it just won't stop sticking out, guys. Then we have the... 
Toxtricity v Shiny. I knew it, man. I flipping knew it. I saw his little hand. Like, I saw his little hand sticking out. And then we have a, ooh, a double hit pack, a Indie DV and a Toxtricity V. Very, very nice. And again, I can't even look at the card. I can't even see the detail without the shine hitting me. It's amazing. And uh, not bad centering either. So there we go. We'll take that. Toxtricity V, Eternator's VMAX, Grim Snarl V, and a Gruden. And let's not forget the Indie DV as well. Right, next up, we've got the Charizard in the front of the pack. Let's see if we can get Charizard inside the pack. Now, I've got to be really careful this time to not show any spoilers off. We have a Grass Energy, Rotom, Cramorant, Thwacky, Cufant, Snom on a bench, Yanma, Gossifleur, Eevee. We have a, ooh, a shiny Oranguru. Great card to pull. This is super playable as well. Once during your turn, you may switch a card from your hand with the top card of your deck. Very useful. And also, who can forget? Wap down. Who can forget about that? Then we have the Celebi, yay. Now, I don't believe we're even 10 packs in just yet, so we've still got a long way to go in this opening, so many more goodies to pull. We've got the code card right there, a Lightning Energy, a Rusted Shield, Team Yell Towel, Ball Guy, Snom, Spinarak, Morpeko. We have a Rowlet behind that, Horsey, a shiny Rune Regus. Let's go. Back to back shinies and a hollow Luxray behind that. And again, we are seeing some cards quite severely off center in this opening right here. I wonder if this mini tin launch was a different print than the ETVs. I guess it did come out a couple of weeks later. So you would assume perhaps Grass Energy, Tropius, Floatzel, Thwacky, Yanma, Eevee again in the water. Love that card. We have a Morpeko. Love that card. Yanma again. Tootle, we have a oh, an amazing rare Kyogre. Yo, this pack opening is on point right now. Amazing rare Kyogre and a Dreadnought rare. Yo, we are pulling banger after banger in this video right here. The pull rates are mad in Shining Fates, I think. Shining Fates, Hidden Fates, even as well. And that's just because there's so many like good cards to get right. So many shinies and so many secret rares that you're bound to get one of them. Do you actually count? Like, do we count Shiny Vault as secret rare? I probably wouldn't, you know. I know like it technically is. I know in in Shiny Star V it is, but it's Shiny Vault, right? A whole different subset. But still, anyway, Trap Inch. Yanma, we have a, oh my life, a shiny Dreadnought. You can tell when it's shiny because there's a star down here. But look at that, green shiny Dreadnought. I actually caught a shiny Tootle in one of my streams. We have a Dreadnought at the back as well. So we've got the shiny version and the non-shiny version back to back. And still plenty more packs to go, guys. So hold on to your hats. I'd even do that. But anyway, hold on to your hats. Don't go anywhere. More packs incoming. We have a Metal Energy, Rooster Sword, Rotom, Thwacky, Spinarak, Horsey, Morpeko, Coughing, Yanma, ooh, no shiny, and then a Celebi. Hey, Darkness Energy, Team Yell, Towel, Cramorant, Rotom, Spinarak, Cufant, Rowlet, Gustafleur, Coughing, is it a Snom? Is it a Snom? Yes, it's a super cute Snom on a bench. And then we have the Zerude at the back. Next pack, let's hope for the best. We have four from the back, give it a tap. We've got the Lightning Energy, Thwacky. Ball Guy, Rusted Sword, Trap Inch, Coughing, Shinx, Weasel. Oh, 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 oh. We have a Nicket. Hey, how the cards that stuck together, man. Nicket. Then we have a Double V. That is a big double. We'll take that. And then a Ditto. A double V and a Ditto. That is what I call a dub. Although I'm not sure why I did this. So what's that so far? Three baby shinies, three full art shinies, a gold Eternatus VMAX. We've been going in in this pack opening right now, guys. Make sure you leave a like if you've enjoyed it. We've got a code card right there. Four from the back. We're going to give it a tap for a good look. We got a grass energy. Cramorant, Tropius, Ball Guy, Coughing, Weasel, Trap Inch, Rowlet, Nicket. We have a. Oh. That's a shiny, a Bunnelby shiny, baby shiny. And then we have a Luxray Hollow again. So another pack with two hits. Okay, I think three more packs to go, including this one right here. So let's hope for some good luck. We've had some good luck in the entire video. Some great cards have been pulled, but let's see if we can take that one step further. Maybe a VMAX shiny, maybe a Charizard. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Tootle, Rowlet. We have a Tropinch. Tropinch? It's coughing. Shinx, we have something. A reverse holo Dartrix, and this card, I can tell what it is already. We can see the rainbow in the back. We can see it's not a shiny because it's not a, well, it's not here. We've got a reverse one instead. So this is going to be the Alcremie VMAX. Look, I'm going to look. Boom. 
I told you. Let's go. Not that I'm not happy or excited, but I've pulled this card so many times in Shining Fate. And I haven't really opened too many packs. There we go. Our crew meet VMAX. Wow. But yeah, what an opening so far, man. Rainbow rares, gold cards, full arts, baby shinies. We've literally had it all. The only thing we haven't pulled yet is a shiny VMAX, okay? And this is our penultimate pack right here. We've got two more packs, including this one, to do that. Let's see if we can get lucky and get that. Oh, we've also not had a full art trainer either, like ball guy or something like that. So we need either a, either a VMAX shiny or a full art trainer or both. We have a Nickit, so it's not possible to get both now. Zerud at the back as well. But we do have one final pack, so let's hope. Either a full art trainer or a shiny VMAX. Come on. Come on, guys. Pause the video right now. Hashtag last pack look in the comments. Type that comment that right now if you're a fan and if you want to wish us some good luck right now. Also, predict what card we're going to get as well as a comment. Let's see. We have a darkness energy. That's good. I like to see that in these videos. We have a Team Yell Towel. Ball Guy. Come on. Dartrix. Cacnea. Gossip Fleur, Nickit, Trapinch, Yanma, we have a, oh, a Reverse Holo Luxio, so no Shiny, and then a Zarud non holo at the back. But still, guys, what an amazing video this was with some fantastic pulls, as you can see now as I go through the hits that we've had in this opening. Only 10 tins, remember, so it's a total of 20 packs. I think we did really well for the amount of packs we opened. Obviously, the Grimstar, one of the highlights, the Toxtricity, one of the highlights, and then probably the highlight of the video, the Eternators VMAX. Absolutely fantastic. Indeedy, ingredient. In fact, this Eternators right here is going to go straight into a grade fit. There we go. The best semi ridges around. You know what? Why not them all? There we go, guys. How good does that look? We've got double Grimstar. Toxicity and the Gold Eternators VMAX all in great fits. So once again, guys, thank you so much for watching the video. If you did enjoy it, make sure you leave a like down below. Subscribe if you are new around here and you do want to see more videos. It's not mandatory. You don't have to. But if you would like to see more, click subscribe. I'll see you guys tomorrow for some more Pokemon content. For now, though, take care and peace out.